Hello everyone, in today's video I will show you how to add in your favorite games from your classic Game Boy consoles in your Nintendo Switch. Now if you happen to have a modded or jailbroken Switch, there is a possibility that you can actually play all types of games from different versions of the Game Boy consoles. Now before we start, this video is clearly information and educational purposes only, and I'm not encouraging any type of piracy or any illegal acts like jailbreaking or pirating games on the Nintendo Switch. So that being said, let's begin. So to begin the process in adding in the games for Game Boy, you will need these things. First, you will need a jailbroken or modded Switch. Second, you will need to install the RetroArch app that is used to emulate and let you play all types of Game Boy games in your Nintendo Switch. And of course, a SD card reader and a laptop or PC. Now that we have all that we need, let's start the process of installing games to your Nintendo Switch. So the first thing to do is remove the SD card from your Nintendo Switch and connect it to your PC. Now let's go to your PC or laptop and open the SD card from there. So this guys is the root of your SD card. Now what we are going to do is look for the RetroArch folder and here is where we are going to add in our Game Boy games. So let's leave the SD card for now and let's look for the game file that I'm going to add in. So for this video, I will add in the game of Golden Sun. So here it is, guys. Now let's just copy this and let's get back to the Nintendo Switch SD card. Now in the Nintendo Switch SD card, look for the RetroArch folder and open it. Now inside it, look for the ROMs folder and here is where we will add in our game. So if you don't have a folder, you can make one for a specific type of console and name it. Now, I already made a folder and I named it Game Boy Advance. So, this folder I'm going to paste in our game that is Golden Sun. Alright, now that we have added the Game Boy games to our Nintendo Switch, let's test it out. So, return to your SD card back to the Nintendo Switch and let's access the RetroArch app. In order to do that, just hold the R button and select any game in your home screen just press OK and it will take you to where the RetroArch app is located. Now let's open the RetroArch app. Now inside RetroArch, look for the option load content. After that, look for the start directory and just press OK and OK again. And look for the RetroArch folder and search for the ROMs folder. Inside ROMs folder, look for the folder that we made, and that is Game Boy Advance Game Folder. Open that and look for the game that we just added, and that is Golden Sun. Then press OK, choose an emulator, and click OK, and you're good to go.
short guys so having a modded or jailbroken switch is really remarkable because we can actually play our emulated games like the playstation games and also the all types of variations of game boy consoles here in the nintendo switch but actually sadly this is the only type of consoles that can be played in the nintendo switch and some others cannot they might have some fluctuations and also some lags and you had to overclock your switch and that's a little bit difficult and dangerous for the console so that's about it for a video for today guys thanks so much for watching and i'll be seeing you again on the next video vlog have a great day guys bye bye